going on how are you all today welcome back to gaming with the jd this is the jd and i want to welcome you guys to the jd's dream matches that's right another episode of the jd's dream matches ladies and gentlemen and you know it has been a minute since i have uploaded an episode from this series and i thought that you know i would get started again when it comes to uploading the JD, the JD's dream matches episodes. <laughs> and as you can tell by the thumbnail, we are going to see the Nexus versus the core for this episode of the JD's dream matches. And there is the core, ladies and gentlemen. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and and <laughs> introducing first <laughs> the team of Ezekiel Jackson, Justin Gabriel, Heath Slater, and Wade Barrett, the core. <laughs> Sorry if that didn't sound too enthusiastic, but I'm I don't know why Heath Slater is not present for this entrance. But yes, that's right, ladies and gentlemen. I want to officially welcome you back to Gaming with the JD. And um, yeah, this is episode four of the JD's Dream Matches. And like I said, it's going to be the Nexus versus the Core. For me, that's uh, you know a, a dream match that is super, super slept on. I mean... I know a lot of people have their, you know, critical opinions about both teams as far as getting buried and stuff like that or whatever it is. But, you know, there was a comment on YouTube I read a while back saying too bad, you know, we never got to see a good match between these two teams. And then a lot of rumors or a lot of people like other people saying, you know, too bad we never got to see these guys fight at WrestleMania 27. And I'm like, OK. And that's, you know, pretty much the inspiration behind this video today. This dream match. The Core versus the Nexus. And there you see at the center, Wade Barrett. Ezekiel Jackson on the left and Justin Gabriel on the right. Justin Gabriel, who also wrestles on the indies as PJ Black. And still, for whatever reason, Heat Slater is not present in this um, entrance. And of course, guys, we're going to be seeing the Nexus versus the Core in a traditional Survivor Series matchup. And, you know, I would say this is done. This is being done in honor of Survivor Series coming up. But like I said, I stopped watching WWE and I heard that, you know, the card for Survivor Series this year is kind of lackluster from what some people say. So, you know, this is not in honor of Survivor Series. This is just another regular episode of Gaming with the JD and a regular episode of the JD's Dream Matches. Episode 4 of the JD's Dream Matches. Tor versus Nexus. And I'm going to be calling this match for you guys. Here tonight at Survivor Series in beautiful Los Angeles, California. And you could see the core awaiting the arrival of the Nexus, led by the best in the world, CM Punk. Alongside. <laughs> and introducing their opponents <laughs> the team of john cena the american dragon brian danielson bray wyatt and cm punk the nexus <laughs> man i really love the look on these nexus t-shirts but if you're asking you know the reason cm punk has a different nexus shirt than cena and brian here well I was looking through Nexus logos on Community Creations, right? And I thought, you know, a lot of these look so cool. Like the original Nexus logo and the and the CM Punk version of the Nexus logo. I thought they looked so cool. I just couldn't decide, you know, which one they should all be wearing. So I thought I'd do the best of both worlds, you know? 
But we got Punk, Cena, Bryan, and we'll same thing with Heath Slater. For whatever reason, Bray Wyatt not present in this entrance. But still, ladies and gentlemen, it's the Nexus versus the Core in traditional Survivor Series tag team matchup and traditional Survivor Series tag team matchup rules. You know how this works, ladies and gentlemen. Eliminations can occur by pinfall, submission, countouts, and disqualification. And the last team standing will be declared the winner. Obviously, guys, a long history between with all these guys. You know, aside from Ezekiel Jackson, guys, we know Wade Barrett, the original leader of the Nexus. Justin Gabriel and Heath Slater, also original founding members of the group, as well as that man you just saw on the turnbuckle, Brian Danielson, that man CM Punk, and that man John Cena. John Cena was forced to join the Nexus after losing to Wade Barrett at the Hell in a Cell pay-per-view 11 years ago. CM Punk, however, much later on, took on leadership of the Nexus from Wade Barrett by costing him a steel cage match against Sheamus and Randy Orton. But here we go, guys. For one night only, both groups have come back together to reunite for this one-of-a-kind dream match. It's the Nexus versus the Core at Survivor Series in L.A. And here we go, Ezekiel Jackson and CM Punk are going to start things off. And here we go, Ezekiel Jackson, first shot in, snapmare, and a kick to the back of Punk. CM Punk who came back to wrestling after seven long years, who takes on Eddie Kingston this Saturday at full gear. And away, Justin Gabriel, legal now on Hurricane Rana by Gabriel. Punk with the right hand. Missed the clothesline, oh God, vicious kick by Punk. Spinning kick to the face of Justin Gabriel. And tag, here comes Brian Danielson. Danielson and Gabriel. Wait a minute, Justin Gabriel? Running, swinging neck breaker. By the high flyer from Cape Town, South Africa. Missed the kick. Danielson, smart. Danielson now. Snap suplex to Gabriel. Down goes Gabriel. Oh God, roundhouse kick to Gabriel. Danielson. He's got Justin Gabriel in a world of trouble. Justin Gabriel, like I said, who also wrestles on the indies as PJ Black. Oh God, Brian raking at the eyes of Gabriel and a shot to the arm. Right hand by Brian. Nice suplex by Danielson. Gabriel back up to his feet though quickly like it was nothing. Gonna send Brian into the ropes. Gabriel plants Danielson and tag here comes the one-man rock band Heat Slater baby Slater missed something obviously Danielson and Slater know each other very very well Brian with the guillotine locked in on Slater what's Slater gonna do here wait a minute no Slater countered it wait a minute Heat Slater oh the original dirty deeds and the the you know, the rose plant, shades of Dean Ambrose and Bailey and Dean Ambrose, John Moxley, whatever you want to call him. Like I said, ladies and gentlemen, I want to wish him nothing but the best of wishes as he still is in rehab, alcohol rehab. He's been there since last week. But now, guys, tag, here comes John Cena. Like I said, John Cena, who was forced by Wade Barrett to join the Nexus and was put through a number of hell for a couple of months. Sorry, was put through hell for a number of months. Slater with a spine buster to Cena. Heat Slater and John Cena are no strangers to each other. Snapmare takedown by Slater. Oh, man. Elbow shot to the head. Obviously, guys, Slater not representing the Nexus tonight. No, Slater and Gabriel left the Nexus when they refused to hit each other with kendo sticks because of an initiation by CM Punk. And as... And because of that, they joined the core alongside Wade Barrett, who was kicked out of the Nexus by Punk. And Ezekiel Jackson, who just allied himself, aligned himself with those three superstars. Cena swatting Slater away. John Cena's got a hold of Heat Slater. What's going on here? Oh, God. Slamming him head first into the corner. Face first into the corner, I should say. Into the turnbuckle. Snake eyes by Cena. Shades of the Undertaker. Oh God, John Cena, sit out power bomb to Heath Slater. 
Wade Barrett and Ezekiel Jackson on the apron waiting for a tag. And tag, here comes Ezekiel Jackson, the personification of domination. Vicious clothesline to Cena. And tag, here comes Bray Wyatt, who wrestled as Husky Harris. Husky Harris, a former member of the Nexus, recruited by Wade Barrett. And Wyatt looking for the first elimination, but Jackson kicks out at one. Oh God, vicious strike by Wyatt to Jackson. Vicious clothesline by Wyatt to Jackson. Oh God, vicious headbutt by Wyatt to Jackson. John Cena down. Outside of the ring as well as Heat Slater, but Slater getting back up. Jackson gonna send Wyatt into the wrong part of town, the wrong corner. Oh God, Bray Wyatt in the corner of the core. And Jackson with the DDT. DDT by Ezekiel Jackson. Looking for the first elimination to eliminate the Eater of Worlds. Bray Wyatt, no. Now Bray Wyatt this time kicks out at one. Much to the chagrin of Ezekiel Jackson. Jackson scouted it. Kicked by Bray. And a vicious clothesline. Here's the cover to eliminate Jackson. No, again. Pops the shoulder up at one. Bray Wyatt, oh my god. Oh, vicious suplex toss. And tag, here comes John Cena. Cena back in. And now tag, here comes Brian Danielson, who meets Miro this Saturday at Full Gear in the finals of the AEW World Championship Eliminator Tournament. Jackson's got a hold of Danielson. And a Michinoku driver, like takedown maneuver off the shoulders of Jackson. Ezekiel Jackson having his way with Brian Danielson. Oh God, now Brian in the wrong part of town. Spoke too soon, oh. Jackson, oh no, he's got Brian. Ezekiel Jackson, what does he have in mind? Oh God, sending Brian face first into the turnbuckle. Oh no, Jackson in trouble. Brian, wait a minute, Ezekiel Jackson. Oh, God, vicious shot to the left arm and down goes Ezekiel. Gonna crawl to the core. Wait, no. Statmare. Jackson, oh God. Vicious elbow strikes to the head of Brian, but a kip up by Brian like it was nothing. Hurricane Rana by Danielson. Oh, looking for the yes kicks, but Jackson scouted it well. Vicious clothesline to Danielson. Ezekiel Jackson feeling the love of the Staples Center in LA. And John Cena was tagged back in, but Jackson way too smart for the franchise there. But Cena, vicious shot. To Jackson, clothesline, but no, Cena flying out of the ring. Jackson out of the ring as well. And remember, guys, countouts are in effect. Both John Cena and Ezekiel Jackson have till 10 to get back inside the ring. Otherwise, they would be eliminated. Jackson and Cena going at it outside. And Cena sends Jackson running around the place Cena back in the ring Ezekiel Jackson down John Cena breaks the count and restarts it to a one to a one count John Cena powering powering away hammering away on Ezekiel Jackson and a fisherman suplex on the steps oh god Ezekiel Jackson now has momentum in his favor. Turns it around on John Cena, sending him into the steps. The core now in control. I'm gonna send Cena running around now, returning the favor. Ezekiel Jackson taunting these LA fans in the front row. But these guys have to the count of 10. I would hate to see these guys get eliminated like that. Oh no. John Cena might be done for, as well as Ezekiel Jackson. Oh no! John Cena has been eliminated. 
My gosh, guys, the count out results in John Cena and Ezekiel Jackson getting eliminated, which means Bray Wyatt and Justin Gabriel are legal now. Gabriel, Snapmare missed the kick. Wyatt from behind with the vicious clothesline. Tough break for John Cena and Ezekiel Jackson, who were eliminated by count out. Wyatt choking the life out of Gabriel. Oh, God. Vicious strike. And now Wyatt with the sleeper hold. Coquina clutch. Locked in. Locked in on Gabriel. What's Justin Gabriel going to do? No, Gabriel's still in this. Oh, I'm looking at the strength. And able to, able to toss Wyatt off his back. Vicious kick and snapmare by Bray Wyatt. Oh, God. Right hand by Gabriel. Did you see the way Gabriel sold that shit? Oh, my God. Gabriel sitting back up. Wyatt. Oh, but Gabriel back up like it was nothing. Vicious clothesline missed. And Gabriel with the running neck breaker. Oh, God. Going to send Wyatt into the corner. Into the corner of the core. Bray Wyatt. He's got a hold of Gabriel. Planting him, oh god, but a vicious knee strike to the ribs, damaging the ribs of Justin Gabriel, and tag, I'm here it comes, you certainly are my friend, oh no, but Wade Barrett, obviously Wade Barrett, the former leader of the Nexus, a member of the core, and tag, here comes CM Punk, long history between Punk and Barrett, CM Punk was the one who kicked Wade Barrett out of the Nexus, and now they're going back at it. After 10 years, guys, hostilities are being renewed between the core and the Nexus. Tonight at Survivor Series in beautiful Los Angeles, California. Falcon Arrow by Puck the Barrett. Wade Barrett, a former five-time Intercontinental Champion. Former leader of the Nexus. Nice back suplex by Punk. And like I said, a former member of the core is Wade Barrett. CM Punk, a former leader of the Nexus as well. Former member of the Nexus. Vicious strike by Punk. Punk and Barrett going at it. CM Punk. Oh, God, a pile driver to Barrett. Pile driver to Barrett. CM Punk feeling the love of the Staples Center in LA. CM Punk, guys, like I said, will take on Eddie Kingston at full gear this Saturday. On pay per view and off the top rope with the Hurricane Rana by CM Punk. Here's the cover to eliminate Wade Barrett. No, kick out of two by Wade. Obviously Wade Barrett, guys, who we once knew as Bad News Barrett. And King Barrett, a former five-time Intercontinental Champion. Former bare-knuckle fighter. Vicious clothesline by Barrett. And like I said, Wade Barrett, a current commentator on NXT. Oh, God, vicious roundhouse kick by Punk. To eliminate Wade Barrett. CM Punk's going to eliminate Wade Barrett. No, Wade Barrett still in this, much to the chagrin of Punk. Barrett kicked out at two. You can see the top rope shaking on the side of the Nexus. Slapped by Punk, kicked to the ribs by Punk of Wade Barrett. And another pile driver by Punk. Wade Barrett might be done for, no. He's back up like it was nothing. DDT by Punk. Oh God, CM Punk doesn't give a fuck. And tag, here comes Justin Gabriel. Oh, God. Drop kick by Gabriel. Catching Punk off guard. Wait a minute. Small package roll up to eliminate Gabriel. Here's the cover. Oh, Heat Slater saving Gabriel and saving the core from losing another member. Wade Barrett down in the out of the ring. Vicious insecurity by Punk. Gonna drag Justin Gabriel towards the center of the ring. Oh, wait a minute. The Anaconda device. Anaconda device. Locked in. Locked in on Gabriel. Oh. Justin Gabriel taps out. You're right, Greg. J Justin Gabriel with no choice but to tap out. It's now three on two. Gabriel eliminated by Punk. Wade Barrett and Heat Slater remain for the core. While Bray Wyatt, Brian Danielson, and CM Punk remain for the Nexus. Car Noble tie up by... Slater and Punk, you just saw there. Vicious clothesline by Slater to Punk. Slater posing on the top rope. And tag, here comes Brian Danielson. I don't think Heath Slater has any idea. Vicious clothesline by Brian. Oh, God. And Brian looking for the yes kicks. 
Yes! 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 Oh, yes! <laughs> Oh man, guys, I don't wish that upon Heat Slater, but the reason I say yes is because everyone used to do it back in the day when he would hit those yes kicks. That's why they're called the yes kicks. But here we go. Brian to eliminate Slater. Oh no. Brian could not eliminate Heat Slater. Heat Slater's still in this as Bray Wyatt tossed Wade Barrett out of the ring. And Slater planting Danielson. Looking for something. Danielson countered. Looking for a drop kick, but Slater countered. Off the ropes goes Brian, crashing into each other. Hate Slater. Oh no! Looking for a suplex. And boom, and he hits it. Woo! Woo! <laughs> oh my god, Hate Slater! Hate Slater showing off his dance moves. Oh my god, what is this? Dancing with the stars? <laughs> uh, it's alright, uh, it's alright. <laughs> Nothing better than having fun, my man. But Brian, oh God. Vicious roundhouse kick and tag. CM Punk is back in. CM Punk is legal again. Running to Slater and gonna drag him. And here's the cover. Gonna eliminate Heat Slater. No, Slater is still in and at one. And CM Punk would, wait a minute, no, Slater had it well scouted. Heat Slater, oh God, kick, DDT, Heat Slater. No, not gonna put away Punk just yet, but instead gonna continue to do more damage on Punk. Face first into the buckle goes Punk and Tagger comes Wade Barrett. Barrett back in. Wade Barrett with the vicious ax handle drop to the left arm of CM Punk and gonna send Wade Barrett into the corner of the Nexus. Wade Barrett in the wrong part of town. Tag is Brian. Punk and Brian. Nice double team by the best in the world and the American Dragon. Brian with the yes chance in LA. Slater back in. Vicious clothesline to Brian. Oh man, Slater. He's got the left arm of Brian trapped. And just like that, the one man rock band showing who's boss. If Heath Slater keeps us up, he might pick up the victory for the core. Oh man, guys, if you're just joining us, this is the JD's Dream Matches Episode 4. We are live tonight from the Staples Center in LA, where it's the Nexus versus the core. Brian, LaBelle lock on Slater, and Slater with no choice but to tap out. Yes, you're right, Greg. Heat Slater has been eliminated, which means it's three on one. Wade Barrett is all alone. I don't know if he has any clue, but Barrett goes to work on Brian and gonna send him into the steps. Guys, Justin Gabriel, Heat Slater, and Ezekiel Jackson have all been eliminated by the Nexus, which means the Wade Barrett is the only one left for the core. It is still, ladies and gentlemen, Nexus versus core. Oh god, Brian gonna send Barrett into the steps, guys. I think it might be over already. If these guys get countered out, it's gonna be done. It's gonna be over. Barrett sends Brian into the steps. And Brian. Oh no. Barrett targets that knee. Gonna pick Brian up. Gonna send Brian into the ring. Oh, thank god. I would hate to see it end like that. Uh-oh, guys, Wade Barrett looks like, I was going to say, I thought he was calling for it, but... Well, oh, Brian and Barrett going at it. Barrett sent, well, Brian sent flying out of the ring. Barrett out of the ring as well. Danielson and Barrett outside the ring, the two legal men here. Ladies and gentlemen, like I said, if you're just joining us, this is the JD's Dream Matches Episode 4. This is Survivor Series. We are live tonight from the beautiful... Staples Center in beautiful Los Angeles, California, where you are seeing the Nexus versus the Core at Survivor Series. Brian, front face lock applied on Barrett, and now a leg sweep takedown. Russian leg sweep takedown by Brian to Barrett. Both these guys have to attend to get back in the ring, guys. Come on, let's go. Let's get back in there. Brian with another Russian leg sweep takedown. Brian, oh, this might be it. 
Oh, God. Vicious basement drop kick by Brian to Barrett. Barrett might be done for. The Nexus is going to win this by count out. Wait, no. Brian breaks the count. And the count restarts. I was about to say, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, God. Vicious uppercut by Danielson. Wait, Barrett into the into the buckle, into the ring post face first. Brian Danielson, guys, who will be taking on the Redeemer Miro this Saturday at Full Gear in Minneapolis in the Target Center in the Eliminator Finals, the World Title Eliminator Finals, guys. Wait a minute, Brian with the yes kicks. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, yes! Danielson with the yes kicks. This could be it for, for the Nexus and for the core. Nexus is going to beat the core. It's over. And just like that, the Nexus wins. That's right, Greg. The Nexus with the huge W. The Nexus wins. Oh, the Nexus wins over the core at Survivor Series. The JD's Dream Match is episode four is over. The Nexus beats the core Survivor Series in this Dream Match. But ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you all so, so much for watching this video today. And I want to... I want to wish you all a very happy early Veterans Day. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, I want you guys to check out AEW Dynamite tomorrow night at 8 o'clock on TNT, the official go-home show before Full Gear, as well as AEW Rampage this Friday at 10 o'clock on TNT. Also, the go-home episode of Rampage before Full Gear. And obviously, guys, AEW Full Gear is live this Saturday on pay-per-view from the Target Center in Minneapolis, Minnesota or you will see Brian Danielson take on Miro in the AEW World Championship Elim Eliminator Tournament Finals. You will see Darby Allin take on that asshole MJF. The best in the world, CM Punk, takes on Eddie Kingston for the first time ever. It's the best in the world versus the Mad King in a dream match that's, years, that's 15 years in the making. And guys, you will also see a long-awaited World Heavyweight Championship match. The cleaner, Kenny Omega, defends the AEW World Heavyweight Championship against the number one contender, his rival and former tag team partner, the man who won the casino ladder match weeks ago on Dynamite, Hangman Adam Page. And so much more will happen this Saturday at Full Gear, ladies and gentlemen. And also, I want you all to know, I will have some AEW Full Gear 2021 match simulations on the way this week. And thank you all so much again for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Stay safe and healthy out there and bundle up during this cold-ass weather. Thank you all so much for watching. Stay safe and healthy. Bundle up. See you guys next time.